Hey everyone, welcome back to another video here on my YouTube channel. I know it's been a while since uh, since I posted on the, on the channel here, and it's been due to the fact that I haven't flown since uh, since the last video back in December. But I do want to say that all the feedback and most of the reactions to the video has been pretty good. So I want to appreciate everyone who took the time to watch the video to in its entirely. I know it was over an hour long video and, and there was a lot of things to showcase and that's exactly what I wanted to do. So the video was a little long, but I do want to appreciate everyone who took the time to watch it all and uh, and comment and uh, and react to the video. So, uh, so that being said, today we are back in the 310. Uh, I'm flying the right seat here today since uh, we are on a training flight. The pilot on the left seat is getting used to uh, flying in the Reno area and uh, I'm training him to uh, fly this 310 in, in particular since I do have over a thousand hours uh, in this particular 310. So we are in Reno departing VFR. We're going out to the west so he can kind of oversee the mountain passes there is in the, there is in the area. Then uh, we're going to request the practice RNF x-ray runway 16 left approach he's gonna go under the hood I'm gonna be a safety pilot and we're gonna do the, the approach to it entirely from the Mustang VR and they do the whole procedure and he's gonna go all the way down the minimums under the hood and I'm gonna be on the right seat to being a safety pilot just be making sure that uh, he's being on track and everything uh, and everything so with that being said sit back relax enjoy the video and uh, like I said thanks for watching this video and, uh, and the vi previous videos and um, Everyone else, um, yeah, thanks for watching and uh, enjoy the video. That's for today. Uh, Footprint 3567, custom weight turbulence, dash 8, part of the parallel runway. Traffic on final is for the parallel runway. Wind variable at 3, runway 16 left, clear for takeoff. Fly runway heading. Fly one, uh, runway heading, we'll caution the wake and uh, clear for takeoff, 16 left, footprint 3567. Lights. Camera. TZGTs. Good. All right. Clear for dig up, dude. Our, our final's clear, and he's landing. We're good to go. You're running heading until they tell you. Yep. Five. Got gauges in the green except that one that's broken. Yep. That's in the green. No flags. Showing good. All right, let's go. Scouts 4751, turn right at November, contact ground point nine or good day. November, ground scouts 4751, good day. All right, good, power's good. Engine instruments are good. Good speed of light, rotate. Good. Blue line, more runway, part of the rate here coming up. Runway heading for now. Attention all aircraft information, Romeo current altimeter 29er, 9er, 9er, wind variable at 3. That little hill right there is very fucking... Yeah, I call that Mount, Mount Carl. Why? Because... 3567, right turn out approved. Right turn out approved, uh, uh, footprint 3567. Uh, because when he when he's here, he's like, goes leaves out of the office and goes, runs up and hikes up the freaking hill and comes back. Really? Yeah. Yeah, so this pass here, you go through that pass, and then as you get close to uh, try to aim 10 5, uh, if we can get stay clear of this guy. So I think we will. Footprint 3567, contact NorCal departure. Good day. NorCal departure, footprint 3567, thanks. Heading 190, maintain at about CFR at about 7,400. Still established on the localizer, clear to ILS X ray. Only 1 6 right approach. Okay, at or above 7,500 and cleared for the ILS X-ray, 16 right, maintain VFR, 2 Sierra Tango. Dark departure, good morning for print 3567, uh, climbing out of 6,800 VFR. Studio 137, North Cal approach, 
Land visual approach, runway 16 left, and you are stepped on, confirm it is Romeo. Truck is 85. We'll do a 137, roger, descend and maintain uh, 12,000, depart, re uh, depart Mustang, I'm sorry, heading 340. Do you hug it or do you fly it across the 45? Yes, uh, you can fly it across. I got a 45 degree angle, like, yeah. huh? Oh, you can do Radio it. Over. 137, affirmative. 1, 2000, depart Mustang, heading 340, vector visual approach. And departure calling off Reno, uh, say again. Uh, footprint 3567, uh, climbing out of 7800 VFR uh, for uh, 10500. Footprint uh, 3567, NorCal departure, right there. Right uh, footprint 3567. Turn the heat on. No, I turn it on. Yeah, but the, uh, the cabin air is running on. Order 3000. 3000, footprint 3567. Oh, I don't know, it was close. No, the defrost is open, that's uh, all that matters. Yeah. Defrost? Okay. Yeah, as soon as you have the defrost, oh, one, one of the, one, either one. All right, cool. It's fine, but that's fine. I was sure. 125.75. Right. Your controls? Uh, your mic controls? 3575, good day, Skyros 3140. Dark approach uh, for print 3567 VFR request. All right, my controls. Your controls. My controls. Your print 3567 NorCal. Print 3567. We're now about uh, let's call it three miles or uh, yeah three miles to the north of Carson City, one zero thousand, and uh, we'd like to put the request for the uh, RNF uh, X-ray one six left. We'll stop. We have Romeo for Reno. Oh, it's just not 310 slang golf. Keep forgetting that. Footprint 3567, Fox 0325. 0325, footprint 3567. It's so weird, the LPV is higher than the LNAV VNAV. Who else called more Oh, is it? <laughs> ah, yeah, just skip this heading here, you'll be fine. Uh, 7 Juliet Alpha Squawk 0347. Footprint 3, uh, 3567, radar contact, 15 miles south east to Reno. Reno altimeter, 3000, Romeo. 3000, and we have Romeo for footprint 3567. Uh, footprint 3567, Roger. You said RNAV X ray 16 left, how will it terminate? Uh, RNF X-ray, 1-6 left, full stop, and uh, it would be full stop, and we like to start it from Mustang if we can for, uh, for print 3567. So print 3567, uh, proceed direct Mustang, maintain VFR at all times. Maintain VFR at all times, direct Mustang for print 3567. Alright, that Mustang dude. Uh, 349. So 7 Juliet Alpha Raider, contact 15 miles north of uh, Reno. Reno altimeter 3000, stay altitude and confirm you have Romeo. So 7 Juliet Alpha Roger, proceed straight in, runway 16 left. Yeah, so 10,000 is uh, the minimum here, so you're good with that. Flaps. Footprint 3567 and Mustang join the approach as requested. Express your clearance uh, closer to Rockville. All right, the uh, Mustang will join the uh, the approach and we'll expect the clearance to close to Rockville for uh, footprint 3567. 1000 on the uh, Mustang 8. President Air 2250, North Carolina departure. So Carolina. he cleared us so we can descend to 86 once we get to uh, Rockville. He hasn't cleared us for the. Uh, for if the approach. If, so that, that, what does that mean? I have to stay this heading or uh, this, uh, what if he doesn't clear us by Nuko? No, he said he could clear, he's gonna clear us by Rajao, which is the, it's, it's another uh, approach, fix, tango, right, initial so approach fix. VFR, frequency change approved. So if we get to Rajao, he hasn't cleared us, we, day, we, uh, what do we do more. usually? Just let him know. Uh, but we're, we're not descending at that point. No, just maintaining 10, yeah. Right. 
And not turning, just continuing straight, or uh, what do you usually do? So he told us that we could follow the approach. Oh, he said that, okay. Yeah, you will follow the approach, but we're not going to get a clean spray by uh, until Rod Joe. All right. A clear saw, that means it's altitudes. Yeah. We get to send through the, uh, the whatever that's a published on the plate. Horizon 2250, turn left, direct window, join Jet 92. Left turn, direct window, J 92, for Air 2250. Clipper 3567, uh, one two miles south of Rock Joe, Rock Joe at or above 900,000, cleared RNAV X-ray, runway 16 left approach. That's Rock Joe at above 900,000, cleared RNAV X-ray, 16 left approach, footprint 3567. Right, we're going to start descending. Yep, at above 9 for Rock Joe, but you're, uh, Rock Joe, but you're good. They cleared us for the approach. Yes, sir. Resident 2250, contact Oakland Center 128.8. 128.8, Resident 2250. Joe to T Boy 8600, 9000. Once I cross Rock Joe, descend to 86. Once I cross T Boy, 78. Cow flaps. Gas. Carriage. Nope. Wait to the bar. Did my turn uh, light come on? Yeah. After uh, we're over at Rock Show now, so what can you go down to now? Eighty six. Oh, there you go. Then 
North Carolina departure, good morning. Well, we're 0152, we're 5,500 on the Wangy 6. Lower 01, North Carolina departure, radar contact, uh, climbing main thing 14,000. Right up to 14,000, roller 01, thank you. Do we could turn? I, I'm, I'm not seeing this, but I'm seeing the, uh, that. No. Uh, yeah, I mean, you're still directed to uh, T-Boy. So you're uh, eight seconds away from the train to final here. All right, turn. Uh, yep. Now turn to what? What? Six three zero three eighteen descending. I can descend now, right? Uh, yeah, so yeah. We we're about about. Yeah, you can go down, descend down. Seven eight hundred is your next step one, down. Nine visual one six right down to one two thousand. So six three zero three. Little 6303, depart Mustang, heading 340, back to visual approach. Okay, so go Mustang, heading 340, climbing 32,000 feet. And uh, direct Wedmo and hold, and then turn 158. 7800 to Seacall, Seacall 6900, ball and a half down, I can put my gear down. Perfecto. Direct Monterey. All right, direct to Monterey, Roller Zero One. Thank you, sir. Footprint 3567, kind of tower 118.7. 87, uh, footprint 3567, thanks for the help. Uh, Reload Tower, good morning again. Uh, footprint 3567 on the uh, practice RNAV X-ray 16 left. Footprint 3567, Reno Tower, wind 300 at 4, runway 16 left. Clear to land, traffic. Or number two, following a Fatabria midfield left downwind. All right, number two, clear land, one six left for print thirty five sixty seven. Right, we have the clearance. Yep. And you have the LPB now. How come the the thing is already so close? The ball's so close. I mean, sitting at sixty nine hundred feet. Fatabria one six Romeo Golf wind two nine zero at four runway one six left clear touch and go. I'm sorry, which ball? Go, uh, uh, half uh, your, 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 so close. your glad path? path. Yeah. Tabria, six Romeo Golf, unable option. Okay. Uh, oh, because I was high. One, 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 How far out is the traffic on final for one six left? Tabria, six Romeo Golf, they are on a nine mile final. Thank you.
Tiberia 6 Romeo Golf. Unable staff and go. All other options approved. Uh, one six from your golf, thanks. We'll keep it. Three green, one in the mirror. Depart. Cool. So, cow flaps closed. Gas, fuel selector. Undercarriage through green, one in the mirror. Make sure we'll leave it. Props. Switches. Heat off. Cool. So, 51.50. Sixty-five for fifty-one fifty. Wind check. Wind two eight zero five. Two eight zero. To the right. Very strong. So high. Two hundred twenty approach speed. Perfect. Uh, 59 for 5150. Yes. Uh, at that point, I would have gone missed because I'm. Yeah, full reflection. Are your controls real quick? My controls? Alright, I got it. Yeah, right here. Controls. controls. Go Go gas. Flight. Undercarriage. Three green, one in the mirror. Make sure. Props. Afternoon tower, shuttle 6303, visual 16. Long right. landing. <laughs> hey, shuttle 6303, Reno tower, only 16 for right. Clear to land, report turning base. Okay, we're turning base now, clear to land, runway 16 right, shuttle 6303. Right now. Room 6, Romeo Golf, wind 2805, runway 16 left, clear for the option. For the option, 16 left, this will be a full stop for 16 Romeo Golf, and we're going uh, back to Stellar. Footprint 3567, turn left there, then contact ground. Left Julie, ground, contact ground, footprint 3567. Leave them closed or cold. Shit, that's cold. Yeah, shuttle 630. Ground, uh, footprint 3567, cleared of 16 left uh, at Juliet 4, Reno Flying Service. Footprint 3567, Reno Ground, taxi via Charlie. Charlie to the ramp, uh, footprint 3567. Oh, so straight to the ramp. Oh, right. I feel a lot better. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, yeah, just uh, just keep an eye on that altitude. Uh, don't bust the altitude. Uh, the one you did for 7800. Yeah. Um, 
on that. Um, other, I think the other thing I could note too is that on final, like we were like less than a thousand feet, you're like doing some crazy banks there to kind of correct, which is fine. Yeah, don't do that. Yeah, just take it easy. It's like, like intercepting a line, you know, or when you're in the line, yeah. you want to. So you're you're less than a thousand feet from the ground, and you know there's Mount. I mean there's, I mean you have, you have that big you have Mount Carl there, and then you have yeah. the casino next door too. So like there's obstructions around here too. How do what do I usually do? Do you usually uh, um, so uh, I I could do it if you want. Your controls. My controls. Is, so I just take it around that garbage can, and yeah. I just sweep it around. Did you taxi it from? Did you take it to maintenance, or did it, the maintenance here? They could, they're going to do it to maintenance. They do it in here, I think. Oh, okay. Well, in most cases, you have to taxi it over to uh, to advance. Yeah, you do. Uh, 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 he said that they they're going to do it here. Oh, okay. And then uh, when you do taxi it over, just uh, just call ground and said you just want to taxi it uh, to Atlantic and. Uh, for the times you have to take it out there. So how come I go fucking just, I do that, like, I, I, I don't know what it is, I just pop it up, and then the nose goes up, and then just fucking, like, what do you do to avoid that? Uh, what do you mean? On the landing? I mean, you just be easy with the, just be easy with the controls. I mean, yeah. I mean, you just, when you yank it back? Yeah. I don't know. I was doing, like, I, I didn't even feel like I didn't do it. Yank it. I just did it like that, and it just went up, and it just all that lift, and it just continued floating. <laughs> um. Uh, just um, uh, I would uh, would I, I forgot to see your speed uh, uh over the numbers, but you, you it was uh, it was blue line. It was blue line? Yeah. Yeah. So you were coming a little bit faster then, because uh, I forgot to tell you this needle sits like maybe like three knots more than what's indicating. If you see the needle being a little bit more. So if you're a blue line, you're probably doing three months faster than blue line. <laughs> so I mean, uh, normally it doesn't affect anything, but coming to land, I would just try to keep the needle below blue line, or if not uh, over a hundred. Uh, trying to land it at a hundred, it's what's what's gonna be preventing you to float on this airplane. Gotcha. Uh, because I tell you, this 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 plane flies, dude. So. <laughs>